Hi everyone, Alex from BIM is here and today I would like to show you a live atomic swap between BIM and Litecoin using our latest version called Bright Boson 2.2 which was just released earlier today. To get started what I need is first is to download the latest version of BIM Wallet, BIM CLI and BIM Node from our website or from the GitHub releases page. I need the wallet initialized and fully synchronized as I can see, as you can see I have here my wallet uh, fully synced and having 10 beams in it. I also need to download the latest version of the Litecoin daemon from the official Litecoin website. And of course, I also need it to be fully synchronized with the blockchain. When I start my Litecoin daemon, I need to specify the parameters for the RPC mechanism, namely RPC user and RPC password. And when this daemon is up, I will show you that at the moment, I don't have any Litecoin in the wallet. But I have arranged with my friend Sergey, who does happen to have some Litecoin, to exchange them for the beams, some of the beams that I have. So let's see how it works. So as you can see, my current Litecoin balance is zero. And what I have done is I have copied the code for beam node into the beam wallet folder, which holds the node DB, which is fully synchronized. I will have to stop my UI wallet first. And now I can start the beam node. And once it's up, I will check that the balance is actually matching my expectations. And then I can actually start the atomic swap. Now we have agreed to exchange two beams for 2,600,000 photons, which is the going rate at the moment this video is recorded. So let's wait for a second to beam node to get fully started and uh, perform the swap. Now all the documentation for the swap is currently available on our documentation website and it actually has the exact examples of how to do atomic swap with bo both Litecoin and Bitcoin. These are very similar, just some of the commands are a little bit different. The commands have a lot of parameters but uh, I will explain each and every one of them so you can also copy them from the examples that we have here and modify the balances and the additional parameters as you need. So as you can see the beam node is running and let's start with running the info command to see how much beams I have in the wallet. Well, it's 10 beams as I have expected. And now what I'm going to do is to paste the actual swap init command. And I will explain the parameters. And on the other side, Sergey has already been running the swap listen command, which is expecting to receive this swap. So what we have here is the address of the beam node that you will be connected to, the node that I have been just running locally. The parameter called swap beam site, which indicates that I'm the one sending beams over. The amount of beams I, be, I will be sending. The fee, which is in growth. And the SBBS address of the Sergey's wallet that I'm going to perform the swap with. We also have the swap coin type selector, which in our case is Litecoin. The swap amount, which is 2,600 photons. The rate, the fee rate for Litecoin, which is very important to get right because otherwise your transaction may be stuck in the blockchain and it will be not, it will not go through. The address and the default port in our case for the Litecoin node and the Litecoin RPC username and password as I have specified when I started the Litecoin daemon. So let's start the swap. I enter my password from my Beam wallet and the swap has started. Now, it usually takes some time for the swap to complete because by default we're waiting for six confirmations on each blockchain and in case of Beam, it's just one block per minute, so it's going to be pretty fast, but it's a little bit slower on the Litecoin side. As you can see here, there are several transactions that are actually being constructed. In addition to the lock transactions that lock the coins on each chain, we also construct the refund and redeem transactions that will be executed either in case the swap doesn't go through, in which case you get the refund, or if it does, in which case you can redeem your swapped coin. Now, all we have to do is just to wait for the confirmations. So let's see how it goes. A Couple of minutes has passed, and as you can see, we already have two out of six confirmations that we're waiting for. So once all the confirmations are complete, I will get back and show you the resulting balance. Okay, so about 15 minutes has passed and we have received the whole six confirmations on our lock transactions on both blockchains. And now the wallets exchange secrets and 
send the redeem transactions which should also get at least one confirmation until we can see the updated balances so a couple of more minutes and the swap will be finished and then we can see what would be the result so the swap has completed successfully and as we can see if we check the balances in litecoin we have a little bit under 2,600,000 photons as expected because we paid the fees and in beam we also have a little bit under 8 beams left because we also paid 100 growth in fees so as you can see it worked perfectly and you are now able to exchange beam for bitcoin and litecoin in completely trustless trustless way directly and uh, enjoy our new feature and thank you for supporting us